What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? It's your girl Blue. Not checking in. Hey, make sure y'all go subscribe to my YouTube channel. All things blue. Again, that's all things blue. B L E U. My phone sucks. It will not play the music while I'm recording. <sighs> See, I think we got one. Yeah. Yeah. BTG that. Did you be that? Yeah. Nah. What's up, y'all? It's your girl Blue back with another video. So today, y'all, we making some turkey necks, some homemade turkey necks. My turkey necks are in the refrigerator right now, soaking, but I do got some smoked pieces. And I got this from Farmer's Fresh Meats in Houston, Texas, like on the southeast side. Um, I got these smoked pieces to put in my other turkey necks. So we eat mashed potatoes. We got the ingredients to smoke my turkey necks, and we're going to do some hot water cornbread. Y'all stay tuned to this video. I do have a special guest today who will be helping me cook, so stay tuned. All righty, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Blue, back with another video, and I have a special guest today, y'all. This is Sanaya. This is my niece. She's visiting me from Dallas. Um, this is my youngest brother's daughter. So she gonna be helping me. And today we gonna prepare, what are we cooking? We are cooking turkey mix. Mm. And also green beans. Green beans, you like turkey mix? Yes. You do? I heard they were good. Um, I've had a turkey neck or two in my life. So yeah, so we gonna get started today, y'all. We gonna wash our hands first. Now this water hot, let me see. Oh, the, the cold water back on. They had the hot water, I mean the cold water off. So we gonna make sure we wash our hands. She cooks with um her stepmom, my brother's uh, girlfriend. So she know what it is, y'all. All right, now we need it. And a little towel. All right, so I already have my stuff sitting out as you seen in the beginning of the video. Um, all right, you can just sit it right there, like, yeah. All right, y'all, so we back. <clears throat> Come on over here, tonight. We have washed these off and what we finna do is make like a little roux real quick um before we actually cook them okay so um i would have like pre-washed these but i really wanted my niece to see the whole process so here they go they are clean all right so what i'm gonna do using our spring water y'all. I'm gonna put just a little bit of water at the bottom. Okay? okay. Just a little bit. Alright. And then we're gonna take like a few of the big ones. I'm gonna let that get hot. But we're gonna take a few of the big ones and basically like make a roux with some flour. I need some flour. the water at the bottom tonight is because I don't want it to like stick. Oh. Okay. Okay. I don't want it to stick. So I'ma actually season my flour. <laughs> this is how they make uh this is how you make gravy. 
which is the same thing as the root. Alright y'all, so we're gonna take some flour just like that. And I'ma just put some little seasoning in there. Some light, nothing major. Put some garlic salt. Okay. Then I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna stir it up. You can smell the garlic. You can smell it, smell good, right? Yeah. Then, okay, so now this is smoking. Y'all see? Okay, that's smoking with that little bitty water. And I can take some of these big ones and sit it at the bottom. Let's see. There we go. Okay. Okay, and I'm gonna just sit these down. I want the ones that's not like that. Oh. Okay. Okay. So they'll stand up straight. Let's see. You gonna try one? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can't drop it because it's gonna splash. to get the turkey mix. They had this and I was like, I gotta try it. Mmm, it pretty good. Mm. It smells good, y'all. So we're gonna- It do? No. Okay, so y'all see this smoking. Okay, so we're gonna add some of these. And I put a lot because um, this is gonna be our base. This is the pink Himalayan sea salt. Y'all know what it is. A little cayenne pepper. Okay. A little spice. We gonna put some saffron, y'all. Just a pinch of some saffron. This stuff's strong. Mm, not too much. Was it strong? Oops. Yep. I guess it was strong. <laughs> okay. Um, we gonna add some of these Tonys. I didn't get the Tonys for this, but I'm gonna add some anyway. Just a little bit, not too much. Okay. And we do have some black peppercorn. I'm gonna put a little bit in there. She can like rinse the rest of the residue off. Okay. And then we just gonna put them back in the bowl. So with the um turkey mix, yes, we're making some green beans and we also making a uh, mashed potato at the request of the family. 
See how they smoking up? And I'ma just brown them on each side. And then we finna get ready to add this flour. Had to make sure y'all can see my guest star. Yeah. It was a four hour drive. Four hours drive. And she ready to go home, y'all. She ready to leave me already. So we need to pour this off. Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah. smoking. I'm going to start sprinkling this. And I'm going to do it little by little so it don't get, it don't get uh, burnt. I need some more water. Just a little more water. I bought the smoked turkey knees, but I don't know if I'm going to use them. Put some more water in there. And I'm going to put more water because I'm going to add some more uh, flour and I don't want it to burn. So now can you get the big green one, the Tony's? Big green Tony's? Yep. There you go. Can you add a little bit? Y'all see that roux uh, going on in there, and it's not real thick, which is just how I wanted it. So now we finna add the vegetables. So now get your vegetables over there. Okay. Okay. We wash the vegetables, and so she just gonna drop them in there. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna let that cook before we add the other ones. Well, we're going to actually start adding them in now. Go ahead and get that bowl to now and start dropping them in here. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. And don't worry, y'all. This is going to cook for a minute. You could go a little faster than that. <laughs> drop them in there and then we gonna start adding the seasonings okay hold on that in that jar okay mm -hmm. okay and then you can grab the seasoning that i had about and i'm gonna add one Yep, and put some of that in there. Okay. You're gonna tell me what you said. Yeah, put it all up in there. There you go. Okay, that's good. Okay, now get the uh the Tony. Okay. Yes. Put some of that in there. Okay, that's enough. Now, we gonna let this boil, okay, for like 45 minutes so they can cook. You got to be patient. Yes, but in the meantime, we got some other stuff to cook. So I'm gonna add some water. 
And we don't need that much because it's already a good amount. And we gonna cover this up so now look. All right, y'all, so we back now. And I thought I had my glasses on. So what we're gonna do now is make some mashed potatoes. Mm -hmm. I'm basically gonna teach her the easy way to make a real mashed potatoes. Not no bag mashed potatoes. Not no powder mashed potatoes. But some real So now we need some of this in that pot of water back there. Okay. All right. Let me see. So what's the other way? Yeah. All right, that's good. And then put it on six. Now a little, little Bernie. Now, I buy these because I like to leave the skin on, but I will go through and kind of cut off like the bad parts like this. So, I'm gonna show you. I'll do that, see? And then I just cut until there ain't no more bad parts. And I really need a cutting board, but I'm gonna just go on. Do it like that. This is all you gotta do when you making potatoes, okay? Right. But see, you gonna rinse them again, so don't worry, cause they gonna get greedy. And I basically am putting like, you know, these little bad spots like that off. But you can leave this on, okay? okay. I'm not gonna let her play with the knife yet, but mm -hmm. she learning. Okay, I am a beginner. Well, you help Jen cook, don't you? Yep. Okay. So you know the basics. If I was using a cutting board and all that, I would let her cut it, but we already behind on time. This started super late. And my family still gotta eat, so. We really not gonna use all of these. But everybody like mashed potatoes, right? Yep. I know Junior was asking for some more. You don't have to go ask them. Mm -mm. No. Yeah, Leave them like be. Like so yeah, we gonna make a lot to make sure everybody gets some. And extras if they want. There are about seven of us in here. Uh, no. What? Well, in the house? Yeah. All together? Yep. Oh, well, yeah. Four. Yeah, it's five, five, six, seven. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot of us, so. We gonna need it. You smell that back there, Sana? Yes, I do. It is cooking indeed. Yeah, that's all them uh, vegetables and herbs, spices. Mm. Smell like grandmama kitchen up in her. Well, not really. I ain't gonna give myself that much credit yet, y'all. Not yet. But my food do be busting. As my son Fat Man say, it's bussy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now tonight we gotta take these and rinse it because potatoes get dirty also. And so we wanna make sure we rinse those a few times. I hope that pot big enough to hold these. See how see how the water brown? That's why we wanna rinse them a few times. Yep, to get all that grit and dirt off. Mm -hmm. All right, so now where you at? I am right here. Oh, there she go. I was like, where she keep going? Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right, so we gonna put these in this pot of boiling water, okay? Now with these, you can kind of, you see how I did that? Yes. Just be careful, cause my computer is right here. 
So try not to let it make a big, huge splash. Okay, but we just gonna pop these potatoes in their water. Touch the water because it is hot. You can kind of like do it off to this side over here, like build up. All right, y'all, I was telling my meat that since this is really boiling, I'm gonna add some more seasoning to it. All right, I'm gonna put some more of this garlic and parsley. And some more black pepper. flour because the water has thinned out so um i probably need to add it now yeah i'm gonna add a little more flour because i want that real thick all right y'all i don't know if you can see through the smoke but that's how them turkey necks should be just like if you cook in neck bones you want to keep stirring them up You can also make these in a slow cooker, but I ain't have time for this today. So y'all, uh, I'm gonna add a secret ingredient to these turkey necks. Just a little bit. It's just like adding ketchup. Cutting them things up for me. Doing an awesome job. We got some uh dang on hot water cornbread over here, y'all. These turkey necks, they were cooking and brewing. And these potatoes are already done. So as soon as she get through doing that, we gonna drain these potatoes. I'm gonna show her how to whip them things up and how to make some smash and smash potatoes. All right, so while she doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and get the pan ready um, for the green beans, y'all. She almost done. That was cold. Mm -hmm. Seven. Okay. Nine, two, three, four, 
She has been such an awesome help. Let me tell you. Ain't nothing like a little assistance. I'm going to have her also uh, season the potatoes before we smash them up. Sit them in the refrigerator. Okay. Okay. Just sit them at the bottom. Go ahead. Yeah, sit them at the bottom. We'll come back to them, then wash your hands. Okay, and then I want you to do the same thing to the potatoes. But the potatoes gonna need more than seven, so you're gonna have to just season it on up. Add all of them except for the red one. Don't add none of the red one. Okay. So I'm going to add one of this. Yeah. Now do 10 okay. and only do 5. Okay. But remember, don't you can't do it like that. Okay? Okay. You got a 1, okay. 2. Make sure you snap back. Okay? okay. She got it, child. I'm going to let her handle that side. I just get it. Nah, you can yeah. leave it right there. Okay. No, leave them over there and then, yeah, just pull one by one. We ain't got a lot of room, so. We gotta make do with what we got. Okay. So Okay. Mm -hmm. And then five right now. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, then the rest of them you need a good healthy amount on this. On and the rest of them, but not the sea salt, yep. Okay. All three of these. Yep. So on the sea salt? These side do like 15, 20. Okay, I'll do 15. 1, 2, 6, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Mm -hmm. On the on the counties, do about, do like 10, 10 on the counties. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. And then on the pepper. Yep, on the pepper, put a lot. Six. I'm going to put twenty. All right. One, two, three, four, Make sure it's five, coming out. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. It's gonna need some more. Okay. We like 20 more. Okay. 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. That was a box. Hey, I'm gonna give her some butter, y'all. Turn that water off for me. You know how to use this? Yes. All right. Smash them potatoes. Okay. I don't know. You might need this. Don't waste them. Okay. 
Is that working or you want this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, get this one. Okay. Yeah, smash on all the way through to the bottom. Try to be careful so you don't lose the potato. Don't, yeah, don't slap it. See, when you slap it, you just push it down like that and go to the bottom, okay? okay. You don't want to slap it because you're going to have a big mess, okay? okay. You want to get all the way to the bottom because you got to smush all of them up. for like 15 more minutes but they pretty much done okay then if you look over here we got the green beans they all done i just turned them off and took them off the aisle and keeping them covered up and then in the oven we got our mashed potatoes y'all see it and they are busting, as my son say. And we got some hot water cornbread. So I might do a mukbang. I might see the kids' expression, y'all. Stay tuned. Hey, make sure you drop a like on this video. Make sure y'all shout out my niece for her birthday, July 27th. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, y'all. Appreciate you for watching this video. I'm out. Peace.
what it tastes like, nephew. Is it good? Mm -hmm. The food? Is it good tonight? Yeah. She know them potatoes good. She <laughs> did them potatoes. Is it good, Dad? Mm -hmm. Teaching fat man how to eat a turkey neck. Wait, this is neck? All right, y'all. Per usual, thanks for watching my video. Make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Share my video with your friends. Uh, my goal is to reach out to the younger generation so they can know how to cook. Y'all be easy. Peace.